Good morning from Alpha Cars. My name is Tom, coming to you from our Northampton location, and today we'll take a look at this 2012 Subaru Forester. Now this Forester in particular is showing just over 67,000 miles. Available via our listing at alphacars.com, you'll find plenty of other relevant information, including detailed readings on the tire depth, brake condition, paint condition, and other features. Also available is our Carfax report, showing an extensive service history, being a fairly low mileage example, makes it a nice value, especially going into these winter months here in New England. So you got that nice ground clearance, nice all wheel drive system. Subaru is known for their capability and practicality going through the winter. You can see the exterior paint. It's in very nice condition. And besides some minor wear on the center caps, the wheels are in very nice shape minor instances of curb rash and the tires are dressed in these very nice Michelin defenders plenty of life left lots of tread left there see all the plastic cladding moving down the side of the vehicle as well as the plastic trim below are all in nice shape holding all that original shine from the factory see another wheel in great shape nice tires and moving on to the front fascia You'll find nice chrome trim, still has that original shine, and the plastic surrounds on the fog lights look great as well. So next up, I'm gonna move on to the interior, give you a quick tour there. Moving on to the interior, you'll find this nice gray leather trim surrounding the steering wheel, the seats, the center console, and throughout the door cards. Passenger seat looks very nice, no wear on the bolster, still holding color nicely. Similar story here on the driver's seat. All the stitching is intact, no wear from sliding in and out. As we hop inside, find this nice sort of felt trimming throughout the door card, very soft, not holding any stains. You can see all of your controls throughout the radio and the climate controls. Still look brand new from the factory. The text isn't worn out of the buttons. Same story here on the steering wheel controls. Car does have heated seats for both front driver and passenger seats. This car has been sitting for a while, so this will be a cold start. No warning lights indicated. Blue light there on the left does indicate this is a cold start. You have your little data screen just there, as well as a nice panoramic sunroof power operated fully automatic just one touch of the switch there above the mirror really gives a nice open air feel to this cockpit so next i'll pop the hood let you hear the motor running and moving on to the engine bay you can see subaru's boxer four-cylinder engine idling very happily off a cold start this is a very very clean engine bay you can see all the plastics look excellent still have that nice deep shine No corrosion even on the bolts here in the front and all the brackets down below. Nothing to hide under the hood here. Even these metal connections throughout the engine still look excellent. You can hear the idle settling out now as it warms up. Overall, very clean engine bay. Certainly been very well cared for. So next on, next up, I'm gonna move on to the Rear seats in the cargo area, give you a quick look back there as well. Moving on to the rear seating area, you can see in the center here you do have some cup holders that'll flip out as well as a little storage tray, as well as an armrest, easily drops down, got some nice leather stitching on there, kind of a nice detail, adds some quality feel back here. These seats do drop down easily for added practicality, all you do is pull this little tab on the top of the seat, they drop down with no issue and it's the same story there on the other side, and easily stow back up so you can seat more passengers. Door cards back here look great as well. That nice felt, soft material, still holding its nice color. And the headliner looks excellent, all the way up into that panoramic sunroof, giving the rear passengers a really nice view out the front. Next up, move to the tailgate. As you can see, the plastic trim here 
in and surrounding the loading area. Haven't been gouged or scratched up. They look quite nice. And here we do have the rubber mat over your rear cargo area, as well as all weather mats for all four foot wells up front. All the plastics back here look very nice. They're not scratched up by animals back here. And you do have a power outlet for anything you may need powered here in the rear. So if you have any further questions regarding this 2012 Forester, you'll find all relevant contact information via the listing for this vehicle at alphacars.com. We hope to hear from you soon. Have a wonderful day. Thank you.